Hey guys, what's up? JK with Porn Reboot here. I uh, just got in from the gym a few minutes ago and uh, my first workout of the day, I'm a little exhausted, but um, I'll get a second one in later on. I, uh, I typically work out twice a day, so I do a <clears throat> cardio or a martial arts session um, early in the day, and then I'll do a weight session in the evening sometimes. I do this about six days a week. Uh, it really helps <laughs> when you work 16 to 18 hour days like I do. And some people think it's intense, but here's the thing. Most guys are not getting the results. You are not getting the results you want early on when you make the decision to quit porn because you're not, you're not applying rather the appropriate amount of intensity. So for instance, um, a few months ago, I said that I'd be much more transparent with you guys. So here goes. In 2015, I started developing anxiety. And being recovered, I understood when something was a risk to my recovered lifestyle. So I immediately took action. Um, the anxiety just came out of nowhere. I just, maybe it was just because of my increased workload. Maybe it was something else. But um, the one thing that I found that destroys my anxiety is working out. So the endorphins that I release due to the uh, sheer intensity of the workouts just makes me feel amazing. And it reminds me of early on in my, my recovery, the first 90 days, um, I had to be intense because I wanted to build new habits and new neural pathways in my brain. And the intensity of my schedule, my boundaries, my understanding of addiction, my self-care, all of that increased due to the intensity. But you are probably not applying the appropriate amount of intensity, the amount of intensity that will generate enough momentum to get you to at least 90 days porn free. So I see men make a strong decision to quit porn and they never identify what their, their triggers are. I see men not setting boundaries with social media, with dating apps and things like Netflix, things that they allow into their heads. You use them without any thought as to how they impact your decision to stay off pornography. And I see men making decisions, not commitments. A commitment is doing something you said you were going to do long after the emotions that you experienced when you made that decision has passed. So I see men worrying about, you know, should I masturbate to release the urge? Uh, will I ever quit? Um, will my dick ever work again? Will there ever be anything as exciting as pornography? What do I replace that feel the feelings I get from porn with? And these concerns then become your excuse to relapse. So you need knowledge. You need accountability. Someone to make sure that you stick to your commitment. You need a mentor to guide you and ensure that you're on the right path without worrying about if you are, you know, taking the right recovery steps. And most importantly, guys, you need intensity early on in your recovery. You know, that's it. That's the mindset that you need early on in this journey. Now, this week, I want to let you guys know that I'm looking for five serious men who want to permanently recover from their addiction to porn and masturbation in the next 90 days. So that's starting off 2019 the right way. We'll schedule a call, we'll look at your behavior, the strategies you've tried over the years or months, we'll find out what works, what hasn't, and we'll also find out the roadblocks that are in your path. And we'll find out whatever holes there are, uh, whatever opportunities they are to get you free from pornography fast. So there are a few rules. The first rule is that you must be over the age of 25 and you must be an employed working professional. The second is that you must have a strong purpose and actually care about your freedom from porn. The third is you must be ambitious. That's who I prefer to work with and you must want to grow. You must also be friendly and coachable. And if you meet all four of this criteria, just email me at elevatedrecovery at gmail.com with the word grow, G-R-O-W, in the subject line, and we'll reach out to brainstorm a plan for you, a recovery plan for you. All right, I'm JK, your brother in this struggle. I'll see you at the brighter side of this journey. I'm gonna go get some work done. Have a great day.